as alpha is a root of x squared add x add 1 equals 0, we can write that alpha squared add alpha add 1 equals 0. Now we also know, generally speaking, that x cubed minus 1 is equal to x squared add x add 1 times x minus 1. Therefore, any root of this is also a root of this. So we can therefore say that alpha cubed minus 1 is 0 or alpha cubed is equal to 1. Now, alpha to the 100 is equal to alpha cubed to the 33 times alpha. And alpha cubed is 1, so that equals alpha. Alpha to the 90 is equal to alpha cubed to the 30, which equals 1. And alpha to the 80 is equal to alpha cubed to the power of 26 times alpha squared which equals alpha squared. Therefore, alpha to the 100 add alpha to the 90 add alpha to the 80 is equal to alpha squared add alpha add 1, which we know is equal to 0. So it's answer A.